All right, people, so this is going to be some unfortunate news for uh, fans of Slipknot because the, the band has parted, parted ways with the uh, longtime percussionist uh, Christopher Finn, everybody. Um, now, the, uh, the, 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 the mighty Slipknot has uh, made the decision to... Uh, uh, part ways with Chris, um, due to, um, due to Chris a accidentally a accusing the band, or not accidentally, accusing them of, um, o opening up other business accounts that, that he was unaware of, and, and, and uh, Chris not being paid his wages for, for, for recording or or going on the last uh, tour cycle with with the uh, with Slipknot. So uh, in this event, um, the 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 band did put out a statement yesterday saying, uh, Chris knows why he's out of the band, although they didn't go into full detail uh, what what that situ what that reason that Chris knows why he's out is, but, um, obviously they go on to say, uh, we, 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 we wish it didn't have to get into the public guy like this, but stuff like this happens, so not, it's an ever-changing and evolving band, uh, and, uh, they, they basically ended it saying, Long, long live the knot. And, uh, uh, unlike most parting messages, guys, it, it didn't say anything like, uh, we wish, uh, Chris the best in any future plans or anything like that. Um, so, what, what, that, that, there is more than just, uh, Chris, Chris, excuse me if I, uh, said Chris around the first time, guys. Um, th there's more than j just these, uh, secret accounts. Uh, that, that, there, there's more, I think there's more of a reason than just secret accounts and Chris not getting, uh, m money that he feels he's owed from, uh, uh, touring and recording with Slipknot. However, um, guys, like, uh, like the band statement says, uh, unfortunately, things like this happen, uh, things always do evolve, people change, you find out that people aren't necessarily, uh, in the band for do doing, doing what, what they do for all the right reasons, and I think, uh, Chris was secretly becoming sort of like a cancer, uh, to, to Corey, Mick, Jim, and Sid, and, uh, Sean, uh, and, uh, the, the other members of Slipknot. I, I think Michael is the one I left out. So, guys, unfortunately, with Chris's departure, um, that now makes the uh, amount of me members in Slipknot that are original down to six because, as we all know, uh, bassist Paul Gray, uh, un unfortunately, uh, uh, had an accident down drug overdose in, in May of 2010 and in and in 2013, uh, the, the band faced a simi- a simi- a very similar situation when, when they had to part ways, uh, with, with Joey on drums. Um, so guys, unfortunately, this does, uh, w we, uh, d demands the, uh, original members of Slipknot down to six at this point. However, in terms of who will, um, 
replace that Chris on the on the upcoming uh, Not Fest Roadshow tour. Somebody uh, reached out to Corey on Twitter and said, "Hey, how about how about getting the original percussionist that was in the band before before Chris?" To which Corey responded, "I I would fucking love that." So guys, maybe in uh, unfortunately having to depart ways with Chris, maybe maybe the not will get up some sort of a moving reunion with with one of its former brothers. So, and uh, just on a side note, guys, but before I wrap this video up, um, I. Just from my personal standpoint, even even though I, I I am not the biggest Slipknot fan, let's be honest. As long as Cor Corey and Sean are in that band, uh, Slip Slipknot will continue in in every capacity. But if something were to ever happen to Corey, it is my Honest judgment that that would not would fall to pieces. Be, because let me honest, guys, clown may be a be 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 the only co-founder then now, now that Paul and Joe and Chris are gone. But let's be honest, it's Corey that that's the star of that band. And guys, personally, um, I. I think Corey has far, far has outgrown his his fame as far exceeded Slipknot. In fact, I wish that one, that when Paul passed away, that uh, Slipknot would have made the more honorable decision not to, not to continue and. And, may, and maybe after this uh, not this road show tour, um, maybe they will make that decision. But but the reason I wish that uh, Slipknot had dissolved the uh, last time they faced a major predicament like this is because a that would have that would and maybe still will will free Corey up to do much. Uh, cooler things, and not necessarily stone sour. But hey, may maybe if Slipknot really was gone, and something happened to Stone Sour, God forbid, may maybe Corey finally could call up Slash and really take another crack at those fellow at those uh, supposedly shelved velvet revolver demos. But this is a Get, get, getting on to a tangent here. So again, guys, uh, Chris Finn, percussionist for Slipknot, is no, is no longer in the band, guys, due to, uh, uh, basically, uh, too, uh, too many accounts that have been opened by other members of the group that he feels he is not being paid. And this is what caught, has what forced uh, Corey, and, Corey and the rest of the members of the Mighty Not to part ways with Chris Finn after 20, 21 years.